Thank you for purchasing the complete system for Twinkles Dental Jewelry application. Twinkles can only be mounted on a real tooth. Ask your customer if you are unsure. Once in place, only a dental practitioner can remove it. By closely following the procedure in this video, you'll ensure a good result and a satisfied client. All components should be easily accessible on a side table. You will need the following. Water, cotton rolls, Vaseline, etch, bonding with a microbrush, flow, and probe. Remove the protective tip from the light curer and keep the protective shield at hand. Finally, make sure that the Twinkles is facing front side up. All components are included in the Twinkles Professional Star Kit for Salons. Always use a new pair of gloves for each client. Make sure you're in agreement with your customer on which tooth and where on the tooth the jewel is to be positioned. For durability, we recommend tooth number two or three. Apply a cut and roll under the lip above the tooth. This is to prevent the lip getting in the way and moistening the tooth. Now clean the whole tooth by rubbing a dry cut and roll in steady sweeps in a downward direction. Apply the blue etching gel in an area slightly larger than the twinkles and leave it on for 20 seconds. Take a clean cut and roll and wipe off the gel in a downward motion. Then take a wet roll to moisten the surface. Apply with a downward motion to assure all etch is removed. With a dry cut and roll, wipe the tooth dry until you have a white milky surface. This is vital to achieve a firm attachment. If you don't get the frosty surface, repeat the procedure. Apply a thin layer of the bonding with a micro brush, but only to the frosty area. Apply the flowable composite to an area a little larger than the jewel and about the same thickness. Dip the other end of the micro brush slightly in Vaseline. Apply it to the front of the jewel to pick it up. Make sure you can tell top from the bottom, then place the twinkles in the middle of the composite. Once in place, it will stick to the flow and you can remove the micro brush by slightly twisting it. Use the probe to slightly push the twinkles around to allow the flow to cover the sides of the jewel. This is especially important with crystals to prevent the glass from separating from the foil. The composite should cover halfway up the sides of the jewel, then thin out around the jewel but not flow outside the prepared area. When correctly positioned, press the twinkles carefully with the rounded part of the probe against the tooth to set it as closely to the enamel as possible. Avoid getting any composite on top of the twinkles. Light cure in a 45 degree angle in all four directions for 20 seconds each, a total of 80 seconds. Don't look directly into the light and use the orange shield as protection. This process locks the twinkles mechanically in place. With some practice, this procedure will take you less than 15 minutes. Visit our website for more information and good luck with your new service.